So this is the stone water. So this is uh, one of the bigger homes. So as you come in, the thing that threw past the bedroom on the right hand side is the openness from the kitchen into the dining and family uh, areas. So quite a big expanse. But let's just back up and I'll show you the house. So as you come in through the door, which is there, you have a bedroom to the right with, was it around the corner there? And then you have the uh, bathroom. This is just a conditioning closet. And then on the right hand side behind the bedroom is a den, which can of course also be another bedroom, depending on how many bedrooms you wish. And then it's just looking back. Um, they, they've had a, a designer in here, obviously, who's decided to put mirrors on these walls here, so there's plenty of light reflected back. Uh, normally that would be a flat wall, and um, they've done uh, some design work here, just the same as here. These on the standard wall, this is what the designer has decided uh, to do. But anyway, as you come down here, we'll come back to the kitchen, but the master bedroom is on the right hand side. And this one has one of the long walk-in showers. You can get cold before you get into that shower, it's so long, incredible. And, um, then just turning around, uh, double vanity, toilet, and again, <laughs> there's people. Some people keep pointing out to me why do they put the closets at the back of the bedroom, uh, bathroom? Well, that's just the way that they built. It's what the designers have come up with. That's what you get. This one has the door leading out. That's an option should you want to take it. Then let's just take a look at this kitchen. So again, just uh, same as all the other kitchens in here. It has uh, gas cooking, external vent, TVs uh, having a little bit of a hiccup there, flashing. Here you've got the walk-in pantry. And let's just take a look outside. So with this model, you do get a lot of outside living area. If I can just... Get this open. So quite a large area under the overhang here. So you can escape the sun if you want to, but quite a large area then for sunbathing. You see you've got four sunbeds over there, they've got two sunbeds over here, plus a fairly decent sized pool and also a spa in this model as well. Now this one also has the option of a pool bath should you want it. Let's take you back inside. Shut this door and lock it again. So let's just take a look through. Oh, yes. There's the kitchen. Let's go this way. I'm just going to go the different way, but we'll go this way. So here is another bedroom with closet. Single vanity for the guest. Here we've just got closet space. And then in here... Garage have, entry door. As you can hear, this is a garage entry door. Three car garage, uh, storm panels there, but of course, if you have the house built, you can always have hurricane resistant doors and windows, so you don't need to put any panels up. And then we have the washroom, quite a decent sized washroom with this model. And there you have it. 
Not just looking back to the door. So quite a large open plan design for uh, many people, um, they go for this design if they have extended family that they think are going to be coming down and staying with them or they uh, still have family with them. But certainly has a number of different options and plenty of space. <laughs>